I've got a Ferrari anodized black TV stand with a caster missing, if you're mm -hmm. interested. How much? It's £4,000. £4,000? <laughs> they would. Anyone here from the Ferrari Owners Club? Oh, no, I'm not going to your <laughs> show. There's not enough chassis are. numbers in it for my taste. Hey, have you, have you seen this? Maths. Can't talk to him. He's doing literally sitting a maths exam. But I bet the conversation in the bar at night is fun. I did more maths than you today, and no, you didn't. I did more maths than you. Oh. Another thing that really irritates me are people who turn up at track days with a bed spring and a motorcycle engine and then say, oh, because they've always got adenoid problems. Oh, this is much faster than any supercar, and it only cost me £3.85. The thing is, though, that people with adenoids are saying in five years' time the Chinese are going to stop buying our cars and we will start buying theirs. In fact, if I had a pound for everyone who said, oh, soon you'll be driving a Chinese car, I'd be able to afford a Chinese car. <laughs> and already he was playing dirty. Get out of the way! They've all been to watch the sunset at Land's End and now going back to the hotel. Well, this is bad, 30 miles an hour. And look at this. This tells you how much torque is going to each wheel at any given moment. Can you imagine bringing that up on a first date? Have you seen this, my dear? Look at that! I reckon you'd be in there. Mm -mm. And now the suspension's been firmed up, but I can make it soft again by pushing that. And if I had a side parting and adenoids, I'd find all this very interesting. I'd come round to your house and tell you all about how it works. The great thing about England at this time of year is that every single village, pretty much every single weekend, hosts some kind of classic car event. People gather in a field, talk about their adenoids and the old girl and... I think we should find one and go to it. Never engage an Aston Martin Owners Club person in conversation because <laughs> they don't talk in models, they talk in chassis numbers. Oh, dear. oh I see he's got big... And they've got an adenoid problem. They all talk like John Major. <laughs> I've had a remarkable experience in that <laughs> <laughs> Of course, at this point, people with mouths of meal would say, and what's the point of all that then when we've got speed limits? You don't have to use all of it all the time is this satellite navigation system you get a touch screen and it lets you choose your language and you can have English UK and English US sort of exactly the same but with extra adenoids obviously you shouldn't listen to those people who say oh we can't tell it's a diesel under the bonnet it sounds just like a petrol because it doesn't it sounds like it's been fueled with sandpaper but so if you buy it in this state and build it yourself, it's 15,000, OK? Yes. If you buy it ready-built, like the Stigs, two and a half thousand pounds more. Think of the fun of assembly. It's not fun to do this. Your wife leaves you, she's in bed with the milkman, and you're like, oh, where's my front suspension unit? This is the new Lotus T125. <laughs> and straight away, an anorak would say, oh, that's not a Formula One car. <laughs> and that's right. It isn't. Uh, but we must move on. We must. McLaren have announced a new supercar. Here it is. It's called the MP412C. Mmm. That'll sound good with adenoids. Yeah, really. Wanna come for a ride in my MP4-12C? <laughs> no, I don't. It sounds like a telephone. However... Thank you. Uh, now, look, I want, to, uh, I want to talk about the new Ferrari. California. Here it is. And that, I think, is the first Ferrari ever with a front-mounted V8 You engine. think? Yeah. We don't want to say that sort of thing in public. You'll have the Ferrari Owners Club coming round to your house in their Mondials. <laughs> Mr. So-called Celebrity So-called May. Surely you remember the B3684 stroke B from 1956. They will, mate. Ooh, they're an adenoidal bunch of they angry will. young men. None of them are... Mostly angry because they haven't actually got Ferraris. Precisely right. I've got a polo shirt with Ferrari on it. No, I'm going to say that that is the first Ferrari in the company's history with a front-mounted V8. That's brave, brave, brave thing to say. I'm going to say something else brave now. You ready? Mm -hmm. That's not very good looking. You're right. I think, I think... Joy 
where you're going to get people coming up to you saying, oh, you could have gone around that corner point. Oh, 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 three of a second faster if you'd had a Ferrari. Oh, you know, that's 100 kilograms heavier than the coupe, don't you? And it doesn't matter. Because I've got 93 million miles of headroom and I've got orange seats. And listen to this. James, I believe now we have a clip uh, from your Mercedes lap. Let's have a look at that now. And we're off. A little bit of uh, tramping from the axle there. And now I'm going to select fourth as we come up to the end of the straight and we go into turn one as we go around turn one. Oh, oh, cop. As you can see, there are bollards on the circuit, which is not what I was expecting and must mean I've gone the wrong way. <laughs> How can you get lost on a racetrack, mate? I don't, I don't, it's, I, it's one way. I know, I don't understand it, I'm sorry. All right, so let's have a look then at a clip from Jeremy's video, shall we? I'm coming up now to the end of the lap. I'm doing 195 miles an hour, 200, 210 miles an hour now, 220, and across the line. What? You just lied and then sped up the film. A bit. Well, a lot. A bit. Well, let's have a look at your lap then in the death yep. trap. All right. OK, okay. here we go. <laughs> and listen to that straight six. <laughs> You didn't take it out. No, I did. The camera broke. I did it properly, <laughs> and I did very well. <laughs> Stop doing that. That's very you annoying. Were a chicken. No, I wasn't. I did do a lap. The camera broke. It just recorded sound. Okay, we've had those clips up now for what a week. 